फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी हैव वन मित्सुबिशी पीएलसी इन दिस पीएलसी सम टाइम डिजिटल आउटपुट इज नॉट कमिंग सो हाउ टू रिपेयर दिस पीएलसी लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड फर्स्ट यू विल सी वाई सेवन वाई सेवन यू कैन सी सेवन इंडिकेटर इज ब्लिंकिंग एंड कॉन्टेक्टर इज ऑपरेट वैन कॉन्टेक्टर इज ऑपरेट मशीन इज रनिंग ओके नाउ बिकॉज मशीन इज स्टॉप सो फॉर इनकोडर कमांड वी रोटेट इनकोडर मैनुअली ओके वैन लेंथ इज कंप्लीट सो देन मशीन विल स्टॉप यू कैन सी वाई सेवन इज कट वैन वाई सेवन इज कट सो कॉन्टेक्टर विल स्टॉप ओके नाउ कॉन्टेक्टर इज स्टॉप बट सम टाइम प्रॉब्लम इज कमिंग when y7 indicator is blinking but voltage is not coming and contactor is not starting first you will see now y7 is operate but sometime sometime contactor is not operate because y7 output voltage is not coming from the plc so how to resolve this problem we will see in this video you will see y7 indicator is blinking but contactor is not operating okay when contactor is not operating our machine is not but sometime when we press hardly on plc body sometime voltage is coming okay so sometime voltage is coming and sometime voltage is not coming from the plc so how to resolve this problem first see mitsubishi plc some basic concepts in this plc we have totten seven digital input which light is blinking that means input is coming okay now we will see for example when emergency push button is pressed so two number digital input will show okay when emergency press you can see for basic information only two number digital input is coming when emergency is stop so two number digital input is not showing okay now in output when seven number output is coming so contactor should start it's for only basic information now seven number लेडीज ब्लिंकिंग सो कॉन्टेक्टर इज स्टार्ट मशीन इज रनिंग ओके वैन लेंथ इज कंप्लीट बिकॉज मशीन इज स्टॉप फॉर इनकोडर कमांड वी रनिंग मशीन मैनुअली वैन लेंथ इज कंप्लीट सो सेवन नंबर आउटपुट विल नॉट शोइंग एंड कॉन्टेक्टर विल स्टॉप ओके बट समाइम सेवन नंबर इंडिकेटर इज शोइंग बट कॉन्टेक्टर इज नॉट ऑपरेटिंग बिकॉज पी एल सी नॉट giving voltage at y7 terminal okay so how to repair this problem we will see practically and step by step okay for now you can see seven number indicator is operating but contactor is not pick up dekhi indicator is blinking but contactor is not pick up because y7 24 volt voltage is not coming for operating this contactor okay if you have this type of problem so you can repair easily okay why 7 is blinking why 7 terminal is here first you need to measure voltage here if voltage is coming then fault is of your wiring okay but so voltage is not coming that means plc internal problem first we need to measure voltage in why 7 terminal you can see we first we need to identify why 7 relay and also we have some problem in why 13 relay Okay, so first count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Eighth number of relay from bottom of the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or eight. Okay, now eighth number relay is here. This relay is for Y seven, and also need to change Y thirteen. So after three relay, third relay is Y thirteen. First you need to mark this terminal. Okay. so we need to change y7 and y13 really first we will open this plc okay if you have like this problem so you can change it really but if voltage is coming in y7 then problem is of your control wiring for now voltage is not coming so we'll change this relay okay first we identify y7 relay and we will change this y7 relay okay first we open this plc okay now y7 relay connect in the eighth number of terminal okay at relay is for y7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 eighth number relay is for y7 first we will count from back side okay first you need to check continuity eighth terminal continuity comes here okay so this relay for y7 
ओके फर्स्ट यू नीड टू मेजर करेंट विच इज फाइव एम्पियर एंड ऑपरेटिंग वोल्टेज इज ट्वेंटी फोर वोल्ट डी सी सो रेटिंग इज सेम सो यू कैन चेंज दिस रिले फॉर चेंजिंग रिले यू नीड टू सी फर्स्ट टर्मिनल्स शुड बी सेम वोल्टेज शुड बी सेम ऑफ द रिले एंड करेंट कैरिंग कैपेसिटी शुड बी सेम ओके दिस इज एथ टर्मिनल वी नीड टू चेंज दिस रिले दिस रिले फॉर वाई सेवन ओके वी विल चेक कंटिन्यूटी कम से हियर कंटिन्यूटी सो वी विल चेंज दिस रिले ओके दिस रिले इज फॉर वाई सेवन यू नीड टू मार्क बिकॉज इफ यू चेंज अदर रिले सो प्रॉब्लम विल बी इंक्रीज सो फर्स्ट यू नीड टू मार्क दिस रिले ओके वी विल चेक टर्मिनल्स इज सेम इट कैन बी चेंज इजीली now for desolding this relay first you need to add soldering wire okay on this terminal so first we add some soldering wire okay after adding this soldering wire your relay will desold very easily okay we add some soldering wire okay and for desolding we will use desolding pump first we add some soldering wire on this all four terminal in this relay we have total four terminal coil voltage plus and minus 24 volt also we have one common point and one ano point so in this relay we have total four point okay after adding soldering wire we use desolding pump for removing soldering okay now first you need to do this work very cleanly okay other terminal should not short okay now our all four terminals is desold now after this desold first you need to okay or straight the connectors of relay okay we straight all the four connectors and you can see we will straight by this plier all four terminal should be straight now we will remove this relay all four terminals is remove we will change same rating and same voltage current rating volt relay now for checking terminal we first check need to fix now terminal is same so we can change this relay easily okay now we fix this relay because this plc is relay type plc so we can change this relay if your plc is transistor type plc so relay could not be changed but because this plc is relay type plc so we will change this relay easily okay we sold all four terminals easily now but after soldering you should check not connector should be short with the soldering now we need to change this 13 number relay so we will first add some materials of soldering wire and we will desold all four terminal of y30 because we need to change two relay okay first y7 and now y13 okay we desold this all four connectors of the relay now we desold all four terminals of the relay okay after desolding all terminals you need to press this terminals for straightening all the connectors all connector should be straight for removing relay okay now you can see all four connectors is straight relay can be removed easily now we need to change same relay you can see first we fix relay terminal is same so relay can be changed easily so we will change this relay okay first we fix this relay and we will sold all four terminals of the relay all connectors or terminals of the relay should be straight now after fixing this relay we need to solding this terminals in this relay total we have four terminals two terminals for coil voltage plus and minus which we need to provide supply 24 volt and one is common and one is ano okay when relay is operate so common supply comes in the ano terminal but in this plc relay is not working because common supply is not coming from the ano terminal 
now we change sold all four terminals of the relay we will fix this plc and we will see how it works now okay relay is changed first we fix this plc now for we will fix this plc and check problem is solved or not okay because plc is relay type so we can change relay easily but if your plc is transistor type so plc relay could not be changed now plc is fitted properly okay after fitting this plc we will connect this plc in the machine and we will check problem solve or not now plc is fit we will connect this plc in this control panel okay in this plc for input and output terminals terminals are given if terminals are not given so before opening and connecting pl need to write connections of all terminals in the drawing also you can take image of all terminals okay inputs are connecting in upper side of the plc and output is connected from bottom side of the plc and this is connecting connector okay and it is output terminal of the plc in this plc we have total seven digital inputs and output okay we have total 27 input and 17 output in this plc now connection is fixed output connectors and it is input connectors okay hope you clear the concept and it is connecting rod and it is communicating connector from plc to hmi it is hmi it is connected from plc to hmi now connection is fixed now we will check problem solve or not machine is starting you can see input is showing now first we will see after running plc when seven number digital output is coming so contactor is operating or not okay now contactor is operate if your indicator is blinking that means seven number digital output is coming so first you need to measure voltage in y7 terminal if voltage is not coming that means your problem is plc internally if your seven number terminal y7 number terminal voltage is coming that means fault in your wiring you need to check wiring of your machine okay because in this condition y7 is coming and also now conductor is operating if your conductor is not operate after coming seven number terminal so your problem is your plc internally okay hope you clear the concept of how to repair plc if you like this video please press like button if you have any query please ask in comments box for today's enough we'll meet in next video thanks for watching